for 1037 The Game and 1037thegame.com. I'm Dave Schultz at Lampson Park, where the Raging Cajun softball team defeats Georgia State 10-1. to Starting pitcher for the Cajuns was Alex Stewart. First time since April of 2012 that a pitcher not named Jordan or Christina starts the first game of the series for the Raging Cajuns. She pitched well, six innings, striking out eight. Well, it was really just the mindset thing and just um, stop thinking while I'm pitching. Just go at it, trust the protocol, trust the process. Um, yeah, it's, just, it's, it's, mo- it's mostly you know, a mindset thing that has clicked. Probably more of, a, of her performance last weekend and the way she handled herself. Um, she was composed and seemed you know, a lot more mature than, than what we've seen in the past. So I, I felt like she was the best, uh, the best option based on last weekend. Cajuns broke the game open with a three-run inning in the second. Shelly Landry with a big two-out, two-run double. And D.J. Sanders finishing the game off with her first home run of the year, a three-run shot in the bottom half of the sixth. I felt really good just because, like, I've been putting in a lot of extra work. And I guess, like, I finally, like, I mean, it's all about the process and stuff. But, like, I'm kind of starting to feel like it's paying off now. Like, you know, so I just felt like I've, like, got a little bit something out of what I've been putting in. Yeah, hopefully, you know, she had a good line drive for her first at bat too, and I felt like she had a, a good swing on that uh, on that particular at bat, um, and felt confident just based on the swing she was having before the home run. Um, so I think she's I think she's definitely getting into uh, into feeling it, and, and the, your confidence is getting up there. Um, but that home run will definitely uh, catapult her into a, another level, hopefully. Coach T.J. Hubbard thrilled with the way the team approached this week of work and the game with Mike Lotif still on the mend. You know, good. You know, obviously it's a tough situation, um, but but I'm proud of the way they they can come to work and focus on their work and, and keep their emotions somewhat in check. And and you know they're caring they're caring for him you know night and day. But when they show up to a softball field, they know that he would want them to be focused on on the on the process, focusing on their skills. And uh, they've done that um, all this week. Raging Cajuns and Panthers wrap up the holiday weekend series with a doubleheader Saturday at noon. Once again, your final score from Lampson Park in Lafayette, Louisiana. The Raging Cajuns defeat Georgia State 10-1. For 1037 The Game and 1037thegame.com, I'm Dave Schultz.